Hello and welcome back to Exponential Knowledge. Today I'm going to review The Singularity is Near by Ray Kurzweil, a book that explores the future of technology and the implications it will have on society. In the introductory chapter of this book, Kurzweil compares the changes that we will see over the next several decades to the magic in Harry Potter. He references science fiction author Arthur C. Clarke's Third Law, which states that any sufficiently advanced technology is indistinguishable from magic. According to Kurzweil, the world of Harry Potter contains its own set of magical possibilities as will the world that we will create with the new technologies of the 21st century. Kurzweil believes that all of the magic from the world of Harry Potter will be replicated in the real world and sooner than you think. Essentially all of the Potter magic will be realized with technologies discussed in this book. Playing Quidditch and transforming people into objects will be feasible in full immersion virtual reality experiences which will be enabled by nanoscale devices. Although a more dubious example, Ray believes that even the time travel scene from the Prisoner of Azkaban is not out of the realm of possibilities. Also, consider the incantations or spells. In Harry Potter, spells must be uttered in the correct sequence with the emphasis exactly right. In precisely the same way, you must feed language AI systems like ChatGPT the correct prompt to get your desired results. In this way, although the world of Harry Potter is imaginary, it may not be an unreasonable vision of what our world will look like just a few decades from now. This comparison sets the tone for the rest of the book as Kurzweil delves into the possibilities of exponential growth in technology and how it will impact our lives. Also, speaking of ChatGPT, it was an extremely interesting experience reading this book just months after ChatGPT was released. Since its release, ChatGPT has gained viral adoption with its parent company, OpenAI, becoming one of the fastest growing companies in history. While this book was written in the early 2000s, it accurately predicted the release of strong AI in the 2020s, which would result in a form of intelligence identical to human intelligence by 2029. In the book, Kurzweil claims that the advent of strong AI is the most important transformation we will see this century, so it was fascinating to read this book as the impact of AI starts to really hit society for the first time. The overall main idea discussed in the book is the concept of the singularity, which is the point in time when artificial intelligence surpasses human intelligence. The singularity is a future period in which the pace of technological change will be so rapid, its impact so deep that human life will be irreversibly transformed. Kurzweil argues that this will happen by 2045 and that it will have far-reaching consequences. He explores the potential benefits of this event, such as increased lifespan, enhanced cognitive abilities, and the ability to overcome major challenges such as climate change and poverty. For example, as a result of the three intertwined revolutions of genetics, nanobots, and robotics, the human experience will be totally transformed over the coming decades. By the 2030s, billions of nanobots will travel through the bloodstream in our body bodies and brains, destroying pathogens, correcting DNA errors, eliminating toxins, and performing many other tasks to enhance our physical well-being. As a result, we will be able to live indefinitely without aging. In our brains, massively distributed nanobots will interact with our biological neurons. This will provide full immersion virtual reality incorporating all of the senses. More important, biological thinking combined with non-biological intelligence will profoundly expand human intelligence. However, Kurzweil also acknowledges the potential risks and challenges that come with the singularity. He discusses the possibility of a gray goo scenario in which self-replicating nanobots consume all matter on Earth in order to fuel their own growth. Overall, The Singularity is Near is a thought-provoking and informative book that explores the possibilities and dangers of exponential growth in technology. Kurzweil's ideas may be controversial, but they are certainly worth considering as we continue to push the boundaries of what is possible. If you're interested in learning more about the future of technology, I definitely recommend checking out The Singularity is Near by Ray Kurzweil. His next book, The Singularity is Near, is slated to come out later this year, so keep an eye out for that as well. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more book reviews and other informative content.